Why not? Because I want to sneak for my birthday and you say no. It's only because we still live with my parents and you know that my mother doesn't like snakes. Well, you can sneak it into the house somehow and make sure that she doesn't find it. Come on! I want to sneak for my birthday! Well, hey, I want to be president of the United States, but you don't hear me complaining, do you? Huh. You're such a creep just like your dad. You know what? If I don't get my way, I may leave this house. Do you have to be such a drama queen? Yes. Look, can we possibly reconsider? Well, okay, I guess I was all the line. Okay, I'm sorry. Maybe we can learn something now. I'm sorry. I was just upset. Look, I understand, okay? You know, we always don't get the way, we don't always get our way in this world, and it sucks. Believe me, I know how you feel. But look, I'm not saying that you can never have a pet snake. It's just, you know what? How about this? How about. When the time comes for us to move out of this house, you know, we, like, try and find a neighborhood where there's two houses for sale, like, one house next to the other, they're both for sale, and you have one house, I'll have another house, you know, we'll be next door neighbors. I love that idea! And you can have all the scary pets in your house that you want, and we can, you can come over, we can still hang out, we'll work on videos together, you know, and we won't have to worry about my fiancé coming into contact with your snake. I love that idea! You're so smart, Dan. You're so smart that you should be a Harvard professor! <laughs> Thank you, Helen. I, I greatly appreciate that. You're looking stud, Muffin. You look as delicious as a Muffin. Helen? You are delicious. You look so delicious to me! Stop it, Helen! Ah!